<laughs> All right. Um, so happy to be here. I'm a little under the weather, but uh, we won't. Don't worry. We won't let that stop us. I'm just warning you. But. Uh, that's why I have all these cups of everything. It's like hot water with lemon, hot water with ginger, hot water with, with water. That's actually, that's one of my drinks of choice. Uh, people think I drink tons of coffee, but what I actually drink is sort of coffee water because I drink coffee and then a whole lot of hot water with it and then you can drink as much as you want as I say often say I go for quantity not quality <laughs> so um, yeah we're uh, I gotta put my watch over here let's see it's a uh, Very useful, those things. <laughs> good watches and good cameras. <laughs> so, um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to read for a while from uh, from my book, and, um, and then we'll talk for a while, and then we'll see what happens. Okay. Messy, but I'm, I'm not even going to apologize. It's just like I don't feel good. I'm on the road. We drove for like six hours to get here, and and but I'm really happy. No, I love it here. I love it. Already walked down the pier, saw, said hello to the seals, and uh, and um, what else did I do? Got some lukewarm clam chowder soup. And, uh, I climb the stairs to my room with its lone skylight, a work table, a bed, my brother's navy flag, bundled and tied by his own hand, and a small armchair draped in threadbare linen set back in the corner by the window. I shed my coat, time to get on with it. I have a fine desk, but I prefer to work from my bed as if I'm a convalescent in a Robert Louis Stevenson poem. An optimistic zombie, propped by pillars, producing pages of sonambulistic fruit, not quite ripe or overripe. Occasionally, I write directly into my small laptop, sheepishly glancing over to the shelf where my typewriter with its antiquated ribbon sits next to an obsolete brother word processor. <laughs> a nagging allegiance prevents me from scrapping either of them. Then there are the scores of notebooks, their contents calling, confession, revelation, endless variations of the same paragraph, and piles of napkins scrawled with incomprehensible rants dried out ink bottles, encrusted nibs, cartridges for pens long gone, mechanical pencils emptied of lead, writer's debris. 